Nova Scotia's Information and Privacy Commissioner is taking aim at Halifax Regional Police over how it handled a request for information from CBC News. The force blocked access to files about the removal of a homeless encampment last year. The commissioner says all of the information should be disclosed. Shana Luck reports. For 11 months, CBC has been trying to use access to information laws to get files from Halifax police about the removal of the encampments and the protests that happened after. The protesters were attempting to get police to stop removing the homeless from the parks. Officers used pepper spray on the crowd. Some protesters and officers were injured, and 24 people were arrested and charged. But Halifax police shut down all CBC's attempts to get more information. The force argued it was an issue of officer safety and personal privacy. CBC appealed to the Provincial Privacy Commissioner, Tricia Ralph. After examining the documents, Ralph recommended all the information CBC was seeking should be released within 45 days. She was also concerned the police chose not to engage with her office during the review. She recommended the police should have policies, procedures and training on the access to information review process. The Halifax police said it was reviewing the report and couldn't do an interview yet. In a statement, it said it tries to strike a balance between privacy and releasing information. The commissioner's recommendations are not binding and police are not required to comply. Nova Scotia's progressive conservative government promised to give her that power, but so far it hasn't done so. Shana Luck, CBC News, Halifax.